for Morning Church. Um, I just thought I would share a little something. What's really made me thinking and what my heart is going into mostly right now are the teenagers. Is this type of time that this time in their lives that they really like to be with their friends and they're missing all that right now. We're home, we're with your family, they might not like that so much. Parents are loving it but kids are really missing their friends and I just thought that I would share a little something for the teens because I know it's discouraging especially teens that are graduating the uncertainty of what's going to happen and I just thought I'd try to lift you up a little bit and Psalm 23 it's always uplifting it talks about trials and tribulations but in the darkness Jesus is always there so Psalm 23 the Lord is my shepherd I shall not want he makes me to lie down in green pastures and leads me besides quiet waters he restores my soul he guides me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death I will fear no evil for you are with me and your rod and your staff they comfort me you prepare a table for me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely, goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. So just remember this might feel that it's going on forever. I feel that way. I'm going a little shack wacky, but there is an end, and through all of it, our lining, our ray of hope is Jesus. He sees our struggles, he sees our fears and our questions, but you could always go to him. And a song that I always love and whenever I go through times that I just don't understand stuff all you could do is just reach out to Jesus and raise a hallelujah so the song raise a hallelujah by Bethel music is a wonderful song to listen to to let it minister to your heart and your soul the chorus says I'm gonna sing in the middle of the storm louder and louder you're gonna hear my praises roar up from the ashes hope will arise death is defeated the king is alive so through all of this uncertainty, Jesus is alive. Jesus is here and he's with us and he's with us holding our hand every day. God knows your heart. You don't need to have a big paragraph to say to him. You could just go to him and pray and ask him to give you comfort and peace. And um, it will end. We will see our friends again. We will be able to go outside again. It's just all the uncertainty right now. So I just wanted to give a little word of encouragement to, especially to the teenagers. I know that um, times like this are hard. And I hope you all are enjoying some family time. And we can't wait to get back to church and see all of our church family. We've been doing church online. So I hope you guys are all doing that. And I hope you could be encouraged today. Have an awesome day. Bye.